All right, let's jump right into it. Um, it is Martin Luther King Day, and I think we should start with a couple of a uh, couple of stories about Martin Luther King. One is um, we'll start with the negative first, and then we'll go to the positive. One is over the weekend, a a, a, a sculpture, a statue was um, uh, unveiled in Boston, uh, uh, commemorating uh, Martin Luther King. It, it is it is supposed to be a sculpture of the embrace uh, that Martin Luther King um, had with his wife um, in 1964 when he uh, found out that he had won the Nobel Prize for Peace, an exciting um, and, and, and thrilling event. Um, and um, this is, this is a, a sculpture that it resulted from a competition. Uh, 125 artists and architects uh, who submitted uh, designs uh, for this thing for this uh, sculpture. And I want to show you, uh, well, one, I mean, this is, this again, this is, you'll also see the scale because there's, uh, uh, so, so this is the, this is the sculpture that won. Um, uh, this is the embrace. Uh, as you can see, it, it's got features of representational art, hands and arms, um, it, it decapitated, uh, no bodies, uh, other than the fingers and hands, hard to tell what the rest is. Um, some of it's a little obscene, like maybe this uh, this angle, which is all over the web. It's it's ugly primarily because it's disjointed, it's disconnected, it it doesn't add up to anything, and it's not human, and it's just elbows and arms and hands and holding something. And there's no Martin Luther King here. There's no his wife. There's no celebration. There's no joy. There's no excitement. It's just, I mean, I think just ugly. It's it's the hands are well done. I mean, fine. And and but but it's it's just ugly. And it's where's the celebration? Where's the excitement? Where's the elation? He's just won the Nobel Prize. Where's the celebration of, a, of, of this amazing man's life? I mean, agree with him or disagree with him, an amazing man. And, and he had a, an, an amazing life, and he had a massive impact on the world. And he, and, he, and he, you know, not that I'm a big fan of the Nobel Prize. He won a Nobel Prize. Great, let's celebrate it. Let's have an embrace. And you can see that, you know, and you can look it up online. You can find the, the photograph of the actual embrace. And you could have made, you could have made a, a magnificent, this is grotesque. It's monstrous. It's it's disgusting. Is it art? Maybe, but if it's art, it's um, offensive and um, uh, just ugly. And it's not doing what it's supposed to do, which is celebrate. And and it's not doing what it's supposed to do, which is Martin Luther King. Where's Martin Luther King here? We got a few hands. Um, it's just, it's just horrible. And, um, you know, you could have made, a, 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 the two busts embracing with the face and, and bodies and it, somebody, and you could have done a lot of things with this. You could have made it, but this, this is modern art. This is, this is the negation of identity, the negation of individuality, the negation of the human body, certainly the negation of the human face and therefore the human mind. It's complete negation of identity. Now, I do want to point out here, self-promoting for a minute, that this is an opportunity for us, you, for you in particular. I have what I think is a really, really good talk on sculpture, a really, really good talk on modern art, on the fact that modern art is a scam in a sense, an intellectual scam, that it is... Um, that it has no clothes, that it is an artist has no clothes. Um, this is a great opportunity to link to that, to share that. I've done so on Facebook and YouTube, uh, sorry, on Facebook and Twitter, uh, it, you know, and, and linked, put up a photo of this and linked up to my uh, lecture. It's so far garnered about 100 uh, new views, uh, which is not bad, but but that's just me putting it up and a lot of People who follow me have already seen this lecture, but but um, you guys can retweet it. Please retweet it. I know Rob already has retweeted. 
please retweet it. Try to get it as much visibility as possible. If we can get people to, to, to watch my talk on modern art, I think we can attract some new people. I think we can at least open some people's minds about the atrocities um, that, are, that are out there. It is the one in Scotland. And again, I've already put it up on my Facebook page and I've already put it up on uh, Twitter with the image of this horrific sculpture that doesn't celebrate Martin Luther King at all and, and is really a disgrace. So uh, please do your share. This is a good opportunity to go to Twitter, go to Facebook, retweet it, share it. Or if you want to go to the original lecture, it's on YouTube and, and just share it from there. But, but include a photograph of this, of, of this ugly, horrific uh, uh, sculpture so, so it gives context. And again, we've got to take advantage of newsy items to, uh, you know, to bring attention uh, to the work we do. Uh, it, it, it's, it's, it's hard to do without linking it to, um, to the news, right? All right, let's see. Um, so that is really all I want to say about this monstrosity. Um, it, but it, it, I think it's in, and, and it's already garnered a bunch of uh, criticisms and people making fun of it and so on. But often, in, in without any kind of intellectual substance, I think the intellectual substance for my criticism of this is on, is in that lecture, and that's why I refer you to the lecture. Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Iran Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.